Hey guys, doing a new work host at the moment. Uh, I don't usually queue up when I'm by myself and it's not double XP, but as I was uploading my last batch of videos, I noticed I didn't have a title card for Yavin, so I figured I would start queuing and hopefully get Yavin. Naturally, the one time I want Yavin, I uh, didn't get it. But I do enjoy Novar, so we will make the most of this and hopefully I can get a Yavin pop before the end of the night. I'm out of range of that guy. Go ahead and use the Sage buff. I saw their healer, but not in time to mark him. There he is, right in front of me. Oh, I am netted. Or at least hindered. Ruining Lives, that's an old guild name. Doesn't seem like either team has an overwhelming amount of DPS. I think both teams also have two healers. I've got these two guys. Very interested in killing me. Doing not a bad job of it, either. Alright, but... We are making some good progress. Definitely take more damage than I can keep up with. Let's get to that guy's shield. See the other healer? Pull him. Nope, didn't pull him in time. I hope he's not the other healer. We have at least one more sage. But we have a scoundrel, looks like, healing me. So I did see another phase walk over there. Phase walk myself. Nope. Hugh, what is Hugh? Is that a new saber throw thing? Not too familiar with any of the recent Marauder changes. But it looked like a saber throw. I'm not even sure if it was dual saber throw or not. And I don't think. Unless I missed something. Oh, we're in trouble now. Barrier to be safe, camp barrier. I broke it but didn't actually click it in time. I think they're going to get south. Hurry guys, interrupt them, interrupt them. Yeah, I think they have the stronger DPS on their team. Because those guys are definitely hurting. Looks like it's a ruining lives pre made actually. Good use of all. Of course, now I can't see you. I can't see any of you guys. Wow, it's like I don't even have armor on or something. Like, they're just melting me. I am out of cooldowns now, except for. Um. My grenade, I guess I do have that. Can't really afford too many heals for other people. One, because I keep line of sighting them. Yeah, they're doing a really good job keeping stuns on me. Uh, and two, because anytime I heal them, I lose myself. I wonder if the fact that I don't have really any of the new augments on my healing set is making a big difference. I didn't think it would. But I, I'm pretty sure the guys attacking me, at least the pre-made, have augments, because I'm clearly taking a lot of damage. Alright, on the bright side... We seem to be holding the node better than I would think. I'm just going to keep rotating cooldowns and try to keep distance from these guys. Alright, I am white barred.
kill that guy because he's in trouble. So is that guy. In fact, this whole node is in trouble. Maybe I can bubble stun some of them. Mm, don't know if I got any or not, and I don't have phase walk down. So that's punch a bump, punch a bump, punch a bunch of cooldowns. It's hard to say. I'm gonna break that. I could phase walk, but I don't want to phase walk out of uh, this yummy shield here. Yeah, it's very clear that. At least the assassin knows what he's doing, because he's using every ability to have he has to interrupt me, which is what he is supposed to do. That's how you shut down a healer. Is that my phase walk there? I forgot which one is mine. Uh, incoming west. I see two of us there, though. I really can't afford to leave south, because people are going to die if I do. Definitely glad I played a healer, because I... This might be cocky to say, but I'm not sure we'd be winning this if I wasn't healing. Healer can definitely turn the tide of a match much easier than uh, any other role can. Good low slash. Took me out of the uh, fight for four seconds and almost led to that guy's death. Now I'm behind. Oh, see, if I hadn't been stunned those four seconds, I would have gotten off that deliverance four seconds sooner. Probably shouldn't use deliverance there. Thought I had enough time. Clearly I was mistaken. Alright, so Luxia there. It's finally given up on killing me. Well, maybe I spoke too soon. Seemed like he was on the other healer. Alright, so we're actually doing pretty good as far as defense goes. We can just keep this up a little longer. I am hindered. Seems like a couple of them are focus firing as well. I guess the good news is that if a lot of their stronger DPS are focusing on me, that leaves the other healer available to uh, keep the team alive. I need to bury her soon. Let's see if he has a breaker up. Yes, he did. Well, at least he made him use his breaker. Running out of force now. We got bubble stone on some of these guys. They're capping, they know they need this. Another good low slash. Not just using it as an interrupt, using it for its actual purpose of stunning you. Okay, I gotta hold out here. Six more seconds. Not six more seconds, six more points, rather. Alright, hard fought win. That, uh, it's kind of surprising in a way, that felt rather tough. Um, Alright, I'm gonna vote for the other healer, I think, because they did a good job. You look at their DPS. The, these two obviously did a lot of spread damage. This guy did a lot of single target. He yeah, almost 4k is not bad off for infill. So they clearly had the better DPS on their team. Um, but we had the better healers at the end of the day. So I will vote for the other Sage. I guess we have three healers. They both did a good job, but as Sages have to stick together. So I will vote for Nissia. Anyway, fingers crossed for Yavin.